With just a shovel in hand, this man tries to break down a barbed wire fence before being repelled. Here near Kuznica at the Belarus border, hundreds of migrants are seeking to cross into Poland, but they've been refused entry by the country's army. According to Warsaw, these migrants were deliberately sent to the eastern border of the European Union by the Belarusian regime, with one objective, to undermine the European Union. This is a continuation of the desperate attempt by the Lukashenko regime to use people as pawns to destabilize the European Union and, of course, the values that, that we stand for. And we uh, have repeatedly, firmly rejected attempts to instrumentalize people for political purposes. For several months, hundreds of migrants have gathered at the border, leading to growing concern by Poland and NATO of a possible escalation and major incident. Polish authorities have responded by deploying thousands of soldiers, laying barbed wire fencing and declaring a local state of emergency. As winter approaches, the pressure on the ground is also taking its toll. Faced with a lack of food and medical supplies, at least 10 migrants have already died in the region. We don't have water, don't have food. How many times are we waiting? This is not the situation. As you see, everybody almost dying of the cold, hunger and everything. Belarus, for its part, has denied weaponizing migrants against the EU, instead blaming the West for the crossings. In response, Brussels says it's now preparing to implement sanctions against the regime. The subject will be one of the key points up for discussion next week in a meeting of the Union's foreign ministers.